Okay, so let's go ahead and we'll go to generator, we'll create advanced Perlin and we'll just connect this mountain to advanced Perlin. Same thing, so what we did before, we just go ahead and add a little bit more effect or pop up this higher to this. So same, we can leave it basic or what we do, we can even pop up more on the effect and elevations, stepness as well. So we can play a little bit more with this. But all it does is just add additional step for you that allow to go and modify kind of your mountain to make more interesting, unique step. So not necessary, but it does slightly um, allow you flexibility if you need to go this way. Um, next, I want to actually combine some what we have right here from rocks and combine to our this main mountain main kind of mountain yeah let's go have a combiner here we'll take from top one and we'll put as the one input and we'll take now from our erosion what we have it from here and connect to another one and now whatever we did with this mountain similar we'll just go to masking okay preview you can see we have a nice kind of applying already not necessarily what we needed, but we have one step closer to add more and more to this. Of course, we need to change slightly in our combiner. We go right side, go to the minimum and go all the way. Okay, let's go click on that one. And let's add another Perlin to this case. Perlin. So this is kind of going almost to our mountain right now. We'll say we'll click right there and we'll set this as a mask as a mask as well. Okay, let's go open. And in this case, we can also modify a little bit more. So we have those rocks. Now all that we need to do is just take and pop up our mountain up. Maybe you know add stepness to this as well. Let's even add ridges. You remember now we have it more flexibility in doing what we wanted. I'll go preview. Okay, so in some case we can try mean, let's try add. So we actually have a little bit more on the rock right there. So we have a bare peak. But mostly what I'm interested in this area right here with the rocks. How say we can take if you need it create mountain you can always come to um specific areas and you can actually increase the size of the mountain if you need it you know just have it a little bit bigger in this case same with combinations and in the end you will have it a little bit more mountain on the middle so we can add those ones what is interesting for me it's this area we can see we have this beautiful rocks kind of almost like pine cone Kind of or some other ones we can add make them as eyes so in this case you have an iceberg small ice maybe around blocking so you can go from that point from um this forward okay so we add so let's go next and we're going to add additional combiners so kind of mix more and more of them together so we'll go right here create new combiner and we'll take this as primary and we'll go take our main mountain and connect there. So just overall blend even more with our original. And in this case, we can go ahead add. So it's add way more. And we can control it. You can see we can kind of almost smoothing or add more in this case. Okay, let's go to preview, lock this. And again, we add it one way. We can go right here. We can even add more. One thing you notice when I increased, we start losing some of details right far away. So it's meaning if we want details go that far, okay, we need to go inside, uh, select height. I think it's a second one. And right here we need it. Kind of, maybe it was first one. So yeah, add this one reduce a little bit. 
and add expand a little bit more to the areas. Okay, right there, maybe two. Okay, so kind of um, erosion to combiner. So we want actually. Okay, right here we want to increase some of this area and that will go with increasing right there okay so on this will increase our rocks and in the end it should increase a little bit more put rocks right here where you can see it okay so next let's um, kind of bring all together this with the uh, inside natural and we'll go to use another erosion correct right there and this is just i'm using so it's kind of combine them almost like blend together all of this effect providing extra um interesting flows and other effect so we'll go right let's pop up our rock hardness so we don't lose some of those segments i'll we'll leave it this you know maybe 270 uh, let's enable and we'll pop up these two around here. Okay, preview. Uh, you can see how it's beautifully um, erosion going and we have those nice rocks going around. Because I, mostly on this tutorial it's a concept, it's help you, but you can see how we can take this area right here with a rock and blending. So if you create your own mountain, maybe like tall mountain or other ones, you can add all this specific effect around there. And the best parts, you can always, if you want different type of, now you can open, okay, and we can go just select total different, the small rocks example. We'll go inside here, preview, and you'll have a tin tiny grid of rocks. Okay, or we can go back. Let's go back to our other rocks increase scale of them and again we'll increase and right here you have it larger rocks okay remember combine them if you need it more so for example we'll just create another one line we'll take this we'll take scale way down you have a combiner here Okay, let's go to put it them in combiner and let's go to add right there. And so now we will have it mix of bigger and smaller rocks. Again, some small rocks, maybe too small. So we maybe want to increase size of this and as well increase size of these rocks because our resolution right now is 530 and you can see we have bigger rocks and mix with smaller rocks so kind of add this edge of the mountain look very nice okay and then next of course what we need to do it is add some of the output nodes and we have it four We'll connect here i also um want to connect node maybe for the rocks and separate for other case so let's go just right now we're connecting remember going inside set what you needed if you're doing kind of Woo or maybe other applications Tarjan work very good if you're selecting and you work with Tarjan, so you can do this and set your path okay i'm going to connect all of this one okay next i'm going to look at this combiner right here and just so connect rocks you can always connect to different for example if you want to receive some other information beside those rocks and i want to connect the other ones a little bit more for the mountain so i'll go for from my advanced perlin but i would like to use actually connectivity select for this so we'll go right there 
can see how nice path going. And we'll connect to next and increase string. So as we preview, you can see right here we have our high field, we have our um, flow, we have a little bit uh, wear, which is kind of nice because about rocks and pops open. We have it our deposit going down. We have our other rocks where we're placing. So if we needed to colorize them, we can go from this map. And we have it also just on the top where we have um, rock roughness. So we have it from this point on a high field if we want to colorize just the top. So very nice output. And we can reuse this in many other ones. So we'll, in other tutorials, we'll look on how to mapping inside the view some of those images and see on a final result.